morning, peoples. It's Monday. Am I all up in my face? It's Monday. And the hubby took a personal day today. I feel like I'm crooked. The hubby took a personal day today because he was tired from yesterday. It is 11.30 and we're just eating breakfast now because we were pooped from yesterday. But We got, you can hear Gio already. I look like death because I'm tired, even though I slept till almost 10, which I haven't slept till 10 in like four years. For breakfast today, we have some homemade pancakes, eggs, Hot. turkey bacon. What are you making tonight for dinner? Lasagna. Uh, eat, mister. <laughs> Grating some cheese on top. What kind of cheese are you using? Uh, we used Brazil. We didn't have any parm. So I only had was. I don't even know what kind this is. Maybe it is. It's Vermont chard. Come on. Oh my god, don't show that. Oh. It's a plastic. Yeah. Trying to kill me. Would you die? Yeah. If I choke. No, but would you die from eating pasta? So yeah, I didn't show you guys the uh, process of it because I mean, lasagna is pretty simple. And you could do it. Eat your spaghetti. Okay, go say hi guys so he can eat his spaghetti. Say hi. hi. Okay. Eat your spaghetti. Uh, so yeah, so I didn't show you guys, you know, the thing, the process, because, I mean, I feel like people just have their own ways to make lasagna, mine's just the simple meat cheese, ricotta. She's lying, she uses stofers. She's just adding more cheese. That ain't true. Well, these, this mess look like fucking stofers? No. Good morning guys. How is everyone feeling today? It is Tuesday and this is us starts tonight. Oh my god, I love that show. Okay. You don't have clothes on, dude. No one wants to see your wiki. No one can see your wiki. Hi. You wanna say hi? Yeah. Okay. Just right here. Come here. They can't see your dupa. Come here. Come close. Okay, I'll show them, but come close and say hi. Hi, guys. Say hi, guys. Hi, guys. Say morning. Hi, Say morning. He wants you guys to see his little easel that he's coloring on. Making a mess in his mama's living room. Tiny little easel. All his markers in chalk. Right? Are you coloring? Okay, color nice and use your little rag to clean it up, okay? You're welcome. So we are going to be making some coffee. Um, I didn't even start my pot yet. Sorry guys. Uh, what else today? Nothing else today on the agenda. Gosh, I unplug my Keurig every night and I can't ever put it back in. Um, so yeah, nothing today. Just staying home. Kelvin's back at work. He woke up with a sore throat today. So that's not good. Um, so I'm not cooking tonight because we have leftovers, lasagna. So that's great. I don't have to cook. Still have to make Gio something, but that's easy. So I'm happy I don't have to cook. Uh, it's my mother-in-law's birthday today. She watches, so happy birthday. We love you.
Say hi, guys. Hi, guys. What you eating? You're far away. Oh, look at that hair today, buddy. You had a good night's sleep. Are you watching your zoo movie? Look, yeah. The animals. Want to show them? See the animals. He loves anything like this. And I like that he watches this. And he could learn better than those cartoons. Right? We're gonna do crafts today. Yeah. Yeah. So good morning, guys. Today is just an easy day. I made some hard-boiled eggs, some turkey bacon because the past two days I haven't been eating that good. So that's what it is. I did my apple cider vinegar today. Um, and we're just gonna stay home and do some fall crafts. We'll show you guys what we make. Who watches this is us. Who watches it? Because set you guys up here. Because oh my god, I thought I was gonna get through the whole show without um crying, and then the last two minutes of it, I was bawling my eyes out. It was so good. So anyone that watches it, I think Jack dies. I don't think he dies in the fire. I think they're trying to like throw us off. I think he started the fire. But I don't think he dies in the fire. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't think he dies in it. So I don't know. I guess. That's a big piece. Yeah. And they're not going to show us for probably until the end of the season. But it's such a great show. If none of you watch it, I think you should go watch Say it. Say hi, guys. Even hi. Have a... Look at mommy. What are we making? What are we making? Smoothie. Smoothie? Yeah. Alright, guys. So we're making our smoothie, which we make every day. Well, kind of like a juice. More. It's not as thick as a smoothie. So, Gia likes to help me every day. We put some ice. Here, put that in. We put some ice in. We're doing some blueberries, some strawberries, and some banana, and a splash of OJ. And we just put it in the magic bullet. And that's how I get Gio. Even though he would eat these fruits normally, like without juicing them. But this is how I get him to eat, like a lot at once. So. I usually add some spinach, but I don't have any today, so that's okay. Um, and then we're gonna do a craft. Put that last one in. So guys, we're gonna show you, what did I just say? We are going to show you guys how we do it. Okay, so first, Gio just put in the ice, right? Okay, hey, your hair dude is a mess. Okay, next. Put it down. Next, we're gonna wash our blueberries. Okay. All right. Ready? Yeah. Let me see your hands. Put some blueberries in. Oh! Knocked it over. Let's cut. Okay. Go ahead. We just do a few blueberries because blueberries. I kind of leave like a lot of bits in this blender. Okay, and then, and then the strawberries. Yeah. Right. Pour it into his little mason jar, and we split it. He gets about that much. I usually taste it. Mm. Mm. Came out good today. So, we are going to give it to Gio in a second. 
That's mommy's, right? Okay, there's yours. Yeah. Mommy's. Cheers. Cheers. Burger. Can you even see that? I hope you can. Turkey burger with some sauteed onions, baked potato, some sour cream, and some string beans with garlic and oil. So that's kind of healthy besides potato, but how's the potato, babe? What? Someone who doesn't like potatoes, he wanted, he suggested, no, suggested? Suggested. Not suggested, when you want something. Suggested? I don't know the word. Suggested. Wow. Uh, okay. Say hi, guys. i a little trouble with Gio eating dinner tonight. He's gonna get his little butt kicked. Just kidding. You know what done? No. Gio's dinner tonight consists of half chicken nugget and some carrots. Toddler life. Right? Oh, you're a good eater. But tonight you're not. So, yeah. Is it okay? Yes. We were just talking about, um, I'm gonna eat and talk. We were just talking about Puerto Rico. We actually, I don't know anyone, but I'm pretty sure you met him. Yeah. Kelvin's stepmother's father is stuck there. Um, they're trying to get him back here. And they can't. Because nobody can even leave Puerto Rico. And his stepmother wants to fly in there, but... You're gonna fly in to get him, but you're not gonna be able to fly back out to get home. I was watching a news. The only thing that only planes and stuff that are allowed in are military. Planes. I was watching the, like some newscaster on uh, Facebook, and he was saying he was in the airport. And he was actually saying that he heard someone died because it was so hot in there. That there's babies in there that need formula. That supposedly there was like a million. Um, water bottles that were delivered to Puerto Rico, but the airport didn't see one of them. Um, and with the backup generators, like where were all the backup generators? Mm -hmm. There's a lot what is that? going on. Ice pop? Okay. Um, it's sad. Wish I could help. Anyway, but it's like if you send your donation there, are they gonna get it? So, and I heard never to help the Red Cross. Yeah. Because I heard that they keep half, I think like 10 cents or something goes to the people that need it. And then I also heard that they were stealing stuff from Houston when Houston was flooded. No. So, every time, which is true because over, I think 10 years ago, where I live, the main area, like the center of town, floods. But, which is where my aunt lives, so she's, oh, she would always get flooded to where they had to take her out on a boat. So, my mom's house one year, and then her backyard is like a hill of like trees and stuff. So, everyone was evacuated to my mom's house. I didn't live there, I was in my own apartment, and it rained so much that it made the hill all mud and it became a mudslide and the, all the trees fell so hard that it knocked down her rock wall and went through her, crashed through her basement windows, cracked the foundation of the house and uh, uh, there was mud and tree roots and trees all in my mother's basement. It was absolutely destroyed. Her house was condemned until it was livable again. 
it was horrible. And Red Cross did absolutely nothing. It is. Hello. This is it. It's called the Teal Pumpkin Project. And it is for children with food allergies that can't get candy on Halloween because it's because it's certain candy that they are allowed to have that is peanut free or soy or dairy or egg what else tree nut peanuts um I think that's it yeah just food allergies in general so the teal pumpkin project is non-food if you paint a pumpkin teal for Halloween so you paint a pumpkin teal for Halloween and you put it on your stairs in the front on Halloween night and then you have candy for kids that could eat candy and then non-food items for children that can't have any candy. Gio can have candy, but certain candies. So, like when he's older, now he doesn't really understand, but when he's older, he can't get, he can't eat the Snickers or the Milky Ways or even the M&Ms or Baby Roots. What else? No chocolate because it's dairy. chocolate is dairy right now. Even if he grows out of dairy, he still can't eat the chocolate because the chocolate could be made on shared lines as peanuts. Gio has peanut allergy and dairy, dairy sensitivity. So on Halloween, you offer candy for the kids that can and then non-food items for children that can't like little toys, little erasers, pencils, pads. The boxes that I just showed you are stickers. So I'll give stickers to little kids who can't have candy. So if this Halloween, if you could paint a pumpkin teal, and put it outside so that people know that you have non-food items to give to little kids that can't get the candy. We would love that you do that for Geo because our Geo can't have it. And all the other little kids. You'd be surprised how many kids have food allergies. So my whole family does it. My aunt does it. My mom does it. We do it. And then they also have a sign. Probably if you just Google Teal Pumpkin Project, you could print out a sign for free. And you could put it on, tape it to the pumpkin, put it on a stick into the pumpkin, however you want to do it, tape it to your door. Because you'd be surprised how many kids really do have allergies. So please, raise awareness for food allergies because it's really not taken that serious as it should be. Some of these, you look at peanut butter and you don't think, like Kelvin said today, he brought, he had peanut butter at work. We don't have peanut butter in the house, but he had it at work. And he said he was looking at it like this could kill somebody. And it's true. And it's scary. So please go get yourself some teal paint and paint a pumpkin. Good morning, guys. It is Friday, September 29th. And I'm in long sleeves. Look at that. It's chilly outside and I'm not complaining. Um, so yeah, it's Friday. I'm just picking up the camera now. It's 10.07. It's been a little hectic here. And now we're about to go to my mom's to do laundry. So, that's all that we have planned for today is just laundry, 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 because Calvin works half day tomorrow, so I won't be able to do it then. And Sunday, I just want to relax. Um, what else? Today is National Coffee Day, so it's free coffee at Wawa, so I will be stopping there before I do my laundry, because everyone needs caffeine to do the laundry. Well, I do. Today is Thursday and I am recording off of my phone because my 
camera's on my laptop. Well, hooked up to my laptop. Because last night I was up till about 1.30 editing. Because I got a late start. That's why my eyes look like this. And I still have makeup on. Um, so yeah, I got a late start editing. So I didn't fall asleep until 3 by the time I was done. And I usually leave my video uploading through the night so by the time i wake up in the morning because our wi-fi is slow it's you know ready to go up on youtube well that didn't happen my video never uploaded at all so i spent the whole morning trying to fix it and it took about two hours to do that so now it's finally uploading it's on 28 percent so i just made some pancakes for me and geo uh, it's gorgeous outside. Gorgeous. Oh my god, look at these nails. Like, seriously? I think I'll stop putting you guys through the pain of listening to me talk. But you guys are the only guys I have to talk to. I don't have anybody to talk to. Besides Gio. You ate all your pancake? Oh. Wanna see your friends? Oh. Say hi. You see yourself? Oh my god. Say morning. Oh so guys, Kelvin is cooking dinner tonight. I'm using my phone again because my battery's dead on my camera. So Kelvin wants to cook dinner tonight, which is meat sauce with spaghetti. And we got a really good sauce this time, so Let's see how it comes out. I'm gonna show you guys. I have faith in him. Do you have faith in daddy cooking? No. Huh? No. No? No. <laughs> so I have like a pain in the back of this eye and now it's like tearing. I think it's a headache because I have a little tiny headache. So look at this. Like this is like a mess today. I'm just a hot mess. So yeah, he's in the shower now. And then he's gonna cook, and I can't wait to see how it comes out. Push it. Oh. Push it. Push it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I told you guys Kelvin was making dinner, and he did, and it actually looks Fucking delicious. Not delicious. Fucking delicious. Looks really good. That sauce looks incredible. Mm, if your name is La Manzana. So we are going to eat that. Gio's eating his. Do you like it, babe? Do you like your own food? Can you say hi to the peoples? Hello. Peoples. Don't you just wake up every day and you're like, wow, I, I can't wait to go on the Felix Family Vlogs just to hear Kelvin speak. Mm, say hi, people. Yeah, up? have a personality. Afternoon, Jesus. Guys. Okay, so Gio just did something that gave me a heart attack. Um, it's 1.43. I'm just picking up the camera now, making Gio some lunch. We've been decorating for Halloween today. Um, I'll show you what I put out. Some ho Whoa, sorry, Some Halloween stuff. So I put those out, took that from the living room, put it in here for now. My mom actually made this. Pretty cool, right? Um, let's see. We hung a Halloween towel and Halloween pot holder. Um, did this to the TV area, put a little light up pumpkin and set up the ghost with two pumpkins. Um, I did this little table. Can you see it? It's kind of bright in here. So yeah, I did that little table. Um, I did my window, which you probably can't see. It has like this light up skull on it. And then, you know, I love these because they remind me of when I was a little girl. I was outside painting something and Gio was helping me, but I was letting him dip his finger into the paint and, you know, paint it like this. And he decided to take the paint on his finger, right, and go, ah, and he ate the paint, acrylic paint. And I, 
That's probably why I look like this, because I was crying, so don't mind my makeup. I was shitting in my pants. I, my whole body was shaking. I took him. I ran up the stairs so fast. Took him in the bathroom. I was trying to rinse out his mouth. He was gagging. I know he swallowed some. He was gagging, and I was trying to rinse him out as best as I could. And I cleaned his whole tongue off, and he was sobbing. I was crying. It was a nightmare. I was so nervous. So then Kelvin comes home in the midst of all this. And I'm like, oh my god, he fucking ate acrylic paint. Do we need to take him to the ER? I called my mother. She said, no, don't take him. You know, it was just a little bit. And then um, Kelvin's reading the bottle, and he reads that it's non-toxic. And I read the bottle, and I didn't even see that, I guess, because I was just, like, a nervous wreck. But I was fucking shitting in my pants because Gio did that. Right? Yeah, that's my Saturday. How's yours? Your kids eat any paint today? Because mine did. She likes light makeup. Close your eyes. So light she got. See, she's like barely any eyeshadow. Oh, you want to make it darker? And then her hair. Look at look at me. Your lips are beat red on this camera. That's even. That's not even lipstick. Are they? No, I've always had red lips, right? My camera died. Look at her. Turn this way. Look at her curls. She's a sweet sixteen. Wow! Wow! What'd you cook? Oh wait! I don't think we saw you today, guys. Hello. It is Sunday, and we've actually just been lazy today. It is 6 o'clock. We're about to eat dinner. Um, Kelvin made uh, a beni. Is that how you say it? Huh? Yeah. Uh, with the help of Dana from Unhappily Housewife. So thank you, girl, because it came out really good. And it kind of like one part of the skin burned a little bit, but Kelvin likes it. But yeah, so we're making that, some rice and beans, and some broccoli. And we're going to show you guys what it looks like. Uh, let me show you this. Yeah, see, like, it burned a little, but Kelvin said he likes it like that. So, that's why I let it go a little bit. But, yeah. Okay, so, so we just got that. back from Walmart, and I have to say, our dinner came out so good that we didn't even pick up the camera to show you how it looked when we cut it up. But it came out so good. So, so good. The skin, oh my god, was the best part. Now, I feel like I gained 20 pounds and I can't move. But I had to move because we had to go to Walmart and get some things. And I finally got a scarecrow for outside and it's super cute. And when it's light out, I will show you guys how cute the front looks because we decorated it today. I look a mess and I've been getting like irritation all around my mouth. It's like really, really dry skin and it's burning. I don't know, my skin's been really like gross. But Gio got a cute toy and he wants to show his friends, he said, right? Yeah. You gonna make them cupcakes? Yeah. Okay, let's see. Wow, look at that. And then you take this and you go like this. Here's your cupcake, sir. Eat it up. Oh, what do you say? You're welcome. So, 
What else? Oh, my mom has to go for a colonoscopy tomorrow. So she's having a grand old time right now at home. If you've had one, you know what I mean. I've had a colonoscopy about six years ago. Oh, it is not fun. Not fun at all. Um, so yeah, I got to take her for that in the morning. And then that is it, I think. Right? Oh, I, I go somewhere on Wednesday. I'm going to vlog it. I'm not going to tell you guys where. I've been there a few times already, but... Yeah, I'm not going to tell you guys where. So that'll be a separate vlog, so you got to stay tuned for that one. So you guys can see where I went. That's Wednesday. And I can't wait. She's actually one of my favorite people in the world. So I think that's it, right? Is that it? Yeah. We're going to play your cupcake game now? Yep. Make some cupcakes? Yep. 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 So, all right, guys. We're going to end it here. Come here. Come say night night to your friends. Say, we'll see you next time, guys. Good job. Say night night. Oh Say bye, guys. Bye, guys. See you guys.